I'm really driven by themes of healing and how love and relationships can bring people through challenges and difficult times in my writing. Hard Limit was probably the most emotional book for me to write because the story is really based on Erica's part of her relationship journey, but also her professional journey. And in the process of that book, something happens with her business that's really challenging, really emotional to her. And at the same time that I was writing that, I was actually transitioning out of the business that I had run for 10 years. And it was like incredibly emotional to be going through it in real life and then to kind of be taking her through her own journey at the same time. So I think that's the one I'm closest to. I love when I get messages from readers who have told me that after reading the books that maybe they've gotten their partner to read the books and that at the end of the series that, you know, they've found themselves much closer from it. Actually, I think I factor in fan feedback quite a bit when I am going through the series. Sometimes in just fun ways, like I'll ask them, you know, where should they go on their honeymoon or, you know, and have people throw out places that they love. Um, or what color should the next book cover be, and uh, what should I name my side character. Um, and to some degree, like some of the more critical reviews, I, I think I do take into consideration a little bit when I'm tackling the next book, because I really do owe a lot to my readers and my fans, and uh, I want to, at the end of the day, my biggest goal is for them to be happy with the book that I give them. With indie publishing, there's really like a great and very large network of independent authors, um, a really huge romance community. And I think what's different about that community is that everybody's self-starters. Because we're self-publishing, everybody's sort of running their own little business and they're so involved in every aspect of publishing that it's very supportive and very positive. So uh, because of that really great community, I've gotten a lot of positive feedback and, and quality support. I am a Virgo, wicked type A. So like something like this is not something that usually comes naturally to a Virgo. Ooh, well right now I'm watching Banshee, which I love. And it's like gritty and sexy and twisted. My favorites. <laughs> I need six hours of silence, some nice weather, uh, salty snacks all around, my laptop, some books for inspiration if I get bored or need a break, and no Facebook. Well, I would like to first and foremost thank my fans because I could not have gotten through this two-year crazy, crazy journey of publishing and writing and making these stories what they are without your unwavering support and enthusiasm. Thank you so, so much.